Hello everybody and welcome back to the episode of The Streak. We are jumping in again and this time we are gonna go as... I don't know, maybe we'll go as... Um, we did May already, didn't we? Uh, maybe we'll go as Elijah. Elijah's potentially a fun one. Um, he's the he's the little dude with the doggy. I haven't played as this guy in a little while. But basically, with this dude, you mark enemies using these burns and your doggy goes and hits them. It's, it's, it's pretty cool. This guy has some interesting synergies. Um, he's a reasonably strong character, but yeah, really fun. Really, really fun. Basically, we can stay at, keep ourselves at a distance and let him chomp. And hopefully get items that stack up and do some good stuff for us. I'm excited to play this guy. He's definitely uh, one that I've been wanting to add to the sort of play, uh, playlist. Not, not really playlist, but like the streak for a little while. And now we finally have him in order. We finally have him in order. But yes, um... How is everybody on this fine, fine day once again? I don't think I did a question of the day in the last episode. I'm not sure if I did. So I apologise for anyone that was waiting for one and not seeing one. Uh, but today, um, I will I will say, what animal would you keep, keep as a pet if you could keep any animal as a pet? I think it'd be really fun to have an octopus. They seem like really smart, but also quite affectionate in like videos you see of them. So I think... I think having a, um, an octopus would be really fun. <laughs> I think they'd be like really chill and, like I said, kind of quite affectionate as well. And that'd be an interesting pet to have that I don't think many people have probably experienced. Also, I'm just quickly checking out what could be secret room, which I think is here. Um, I've only got one bomb, so that was a little bit of a um, sketchy, sketchy usage of our single bomb. But I think it's okay. But yeah, I, I love this guy because you've got the, I mean, just the, the theming around having this dog going after stuff is fun. But also, like, that explosion of tears he does, that's where we're going to get synergies. That's where our tear effects are going to matter and it's going gonna, it's gonna to start looking pretty interesting if we get, like, coloured tears and stuff. And I'm, I'm waiting on it. Oh, god damn. That, uh, that guy moved in a way. I wasn't expecting twice in a row. Fuck you, dude. That was annoying. Poison tears, there you go. Well, what did you just say about coloured tears? That was weird. I'm not quite sure why I'd want to go around behind that, but there you go. Uh, yeah, I've got to be a little careful here because I've just taken some pretty bad damage there. Uh, that, that, that thing just moved in ways I wasn't expecting, I've got to say. But now we've got uh, green tears coming up and actually him doing poison on his attacks too, which is really nice. Oh my lord, I need to get way better at this game right now because I am shitting the bed in a major way. Right, get gone. I need some HP here. There's no HP here. <laughs> Are you kidding? I was really banking on there being HP. Okay, that's good at least. I very much would like the electric dice if I can grab it. There's apparently a penny in my, uh, in my item room that I didn't grab, which... I imagine, yeah, there you go. Let's go, go grab electric dice, because if we get a good active item, that becomes a lot, lot better. And we did get some more bombs as well. Unfortunately, no tinted rocks, though, which is what I was kind of hoping for. But yeah, electric dice is very, very good. Um, as soon as we get an active, that's going to start going a bit crazy, which I quite like the idea of. Okay. Let's fight our boss and hope we don't die. Really? You have to give me goddamn stupid this boss. Nobody likes this boss. Luckily, this boss is actually not too bad for us because we get to kind of stay away from him. I'm not sure how, like, the stacking burn effect, what that does. But he's he's just munched him to oblivion there. Rather nice, and they get a HP up as well here. Lovely, and a morbid heart. Okay. Okay, feeling better about that first floor now. Definitely. My doggy, he, he do some awesome stuff when it comes to biting down on some bosses. And I like having the poison in addition to all of this as well. Yeah, have it, you can like stack up the burn effect. I don't know if that means they take more damage or something. I'm not entirely sure what that uh, alludes to. I just gotta hope that he can do right by us and protect us when need be. Lovely. Ooh, we get one of these little slow down pennies. I think marking him just means that he'll, like, jump at them rather than just slowly walking towards them. I think it gives him a bit more urgency. Good. good. But he does a lot of damage. He, he, he chomps with the best of them. He is the goodest of boys. Beautiful stuff. You should take that guy out there. 
How about this guy as well? Two hitting most things. It's beautiful. Ooh, golden key. Before we've opened up anything is very nice here. You can even do that as well and jump over gaps, which is really nice. Oh, Lord. That, uh, that hit me. I lost my devil deal chance there. That's my bad. I didn't expect that ghosty to be able to get me there. Ooh, this is pretty good. You can see it doesn't affect our burn shot, but it will affect the shots that fire out of this guy. It's rather nice. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah, it doesn't affect our burn at all. Good. Oh, man. Not being able to fight, like, hit, kill things yourself easily with your own tears can be very difficult. It can definitely lead to some problems. Oh my god, I lost my morbid heart already. That's not good. Also, this this boss is clearly quite difficult because he keeps moving so much that our uh, our friend here is not having an easy time of, of attacking him. Not having an easy time at all. When he does, though, he does good damage, but he just finds it a little difficult, is all. Right, okay. Blood clot's good. Um, I guess we try and finish off the rest of this floor. I'm not particularly happy with my HP at the moment. I took some bad damage there. Again, though, the game is being kind of rude to me recently and not really giving me soul hearts a lot, which is making things harder. Not having soul hearts, like, ever is, is a bit annoying. Yeah, just never having soul hearts. Um, honestly, I'm going to try something here. Um, right, okay, I've got a few options here. So, first of all, let's go for you. There you go. Right. I'm thinking my box of friends will duplicate my dogger boy, which I'm mighty intrigued by the prospects of. Um, secret room, I'm very unsure about right now. Very unsure indeed. Hmm. I, I genuinely have no idea a secret room will be here, so I'm going to not bother with it right now, because I, I just have no idea. It might be there. I don't know. Right. Let's go. I'm interested, because we've got electric dice, and we've got the dog. I'm hoping it'll do some duplicating of the dog, and that could be pretty interesting. Ah, oh, it doesn't. Are you kidding me? He doesn't count as a familiar? Okay, that's fair enough. It's still good to have this box, though, because we can produce... The demon baby, and then also all the stuff as well down the line. Right. You, you, you just stood right on top of my dog there. That was a silly move by you, good sir. Silly move indeed. Okay, I don't know what's going on here. But I don't much like it. How do I get over to the kill switch? Okay, I can't. That's fine then, I guess. That's fine then. Oh my... Dude! It's so difficult when you can't deal your own damage. I'm having a really hard time with this guy. Because, yeah, I, I don't have enough damage to be able to kill stuff. And if my dog doesn't target the right thing, I'm basically just screwed. Come on, devil deal. Work with me here. Work with me. Otherwise, we're in for a bit of a rough time. And also, it's nice that electric dice just isn't proccing. Okay. Well, my guy is stuck chomping a dead body because someone didn't set it to be a dead entity. So that makes things more difficult as well. It's annoying. We might die pretty swiftly with this guy, to be honest. This character is, uh, strong, but not in the right way. Right. Okay, can you die already? I need some more damage. Come on, dude. Find your own way a little bit, at least, doggy. Find your own way a little bit. Oh, soul heart. Oh, my lord. A saving grace right there. 
And you can find this guy on your own, can't you? No. Bite him. I'm so glad we have this poison, by the way. This poison is definitely making life easier. That's half a heart as well. Getting a lot of half hearts at the moment. Still not had electric dice proc yet. I, I'm, I'm thinking that maybe electric dice might be broken. Because I've had it a few times now and noticed it doesn't proc very often. It used to proc all the damn time. So I'm going to keep an eye on it. But I have a feeling that electric dice doesn't currently work. Which would be a damn shame because it's a very fun item. Burn meat burn. Burn everyone up. Oh, for f I'm so bad at this game right now. My reaction time is uh, subpar. Very subpar, right. Yeah, again, only one. I definitely think it's broken. One, one sec. Okay, so I accidentally just ended the recording rather than pausing it. Haven't done that in quite some time. Bit annoying. Um, but we are we are back. I'll just stitch the video together in editing. I don't have to do that often, but... But yeah, it seems like Electric Dice is broken, so I just went and told the developer that I'm pretty certain it's not working. Thank you, we got the devil deal. I'm gonna go in because I, I need some... I need some power. Honestly, it's not the best way to play this, but I think I am gonna just go like this. We'll see if we live as this guy. I'm not going to try to die, but at least we've now got a backup option. At least we've now got a backup option. But yeah, we are pretty close to death right now. Really, that missed? Could that just not have missed, maybe? Get out of here, little mushroom boys. We don't want none of your business coming in and ruining our day. Thank you. I love the chomps. Oh god, I got a leg spike there. Yeah, you see how everything's just doubled. I've got nothing that's tripled. I think electric dice just don't work. And then in here, we've got... Ooh, damage. We like damage. And then in here, we got tears. We'll take tears. Unfortunately, this is probably a boss where I die. This guy is uh, known for being a bit of a prick. Uh, once again. Okay, so this this character's kind of just broken. You can't really play as this character. When it keeps biting down on fucking dead things. Doesn't really work. It's my life a lot harder. Ah, oh, there you go, we died. So we're playing as Dark Judas now, which is not what this episode was meant to be about at all. Um, but we are now. <laughs> I just needed that backup because it didn't look like it was going to be good. Oh, dude. I immediately take damage here. So we might just be dying anyways. I'm not well tuned for the streak yet, people. As uh, as is probably obvious already. I'm not I'm not locked in. To be fair, it's going to be a learning experience with these characters anyways. There's going to be a lot of them that we know are going to be more difficult and stuff. So we've got, just got to sort of be aware of that and be prepared for that. And know that the streak isn't going to be as easy as our last one. Not the last streak was easy through and through. We'd have some easy runs. But some easy characters, whereas now we don't really have anywhere near as many of as, as we did before. Makes our life a little harder. But this character right now we are playing as, we are doing very good damage. And we get Keeper's Balls on top of that as well. Hell yeah. Hell yes. Keeper's Balls. Good, good. Oh my god. Why? I always get you confused with the with the water droplet boss, and so I always do that and get hit by that attack. I'm one heart now, or half a heart, I'm not sure. More damage. Okay. Damage is looking very, very nice, but health, yeah, health is is, is in a bad spot. But it's bedtime, baby. That was uh, that was lucky. 
That was convenient. Really? You're gonna lock up the bed? How dare you? But that definitely, uh, definitely saves us from death at least. I like the fact that even on the dirty beds you still get the healing. No, no, I think we will open these. Three of these could be pretty good. I mean, we're doing insane damage right now. We don't gotta worry about how difficult it's gonna be to kill most enemies. At the moment. I just wish electric dice worked. Man, this would be such a good synergy. With electric dice, but... It does not work. Someone a porky ally. I don't think we need a porky ally. Ooh, a half heart there is very nice as well. Ooh, is that a tinted rock? I think this here is a tinted rock. So if we get a bomb, we can come back to that and utilize it. Or try to at least. Ooh, you used a fire. More keys. Okay, we can get a lot of respawning enemies here, aren't we? Make sure to use that when we can. Oh, got double, uh, double pills there. Come on, yes. Wait, what? There's more? How is there still more? God damn, yeah, we've, uh, had a bit of a weird one. We didn't really get to play as Elijah anywhere near as much as I was hoping. Um, <laughs> not the not the most ideal showcase of a modded character right off the bat, but he's just a difficult character, man. I mean, the that bug, that bug, um, paired with the like inability to change who he's targeting is uh makes him very difficult to sort of play normally and have a good run with. And I think that is going to be a struggle for us going forward, like. Him just targeting dead bodies and like man making making you unable to deal proper damage to other enemies is a real problem. Oh, we got a rainbow champion here. Didn't realize. Didn't realize that was a rainbow champion. And I took some bad damage to him. Right. With parasite, we're also wiping things up pretty quickly too. It's nice. We've lost quite a lot of health here already. Not done a great job at staying healthy, have I? What the hell baby is this? Scarlet Infant. Block shots, um, killing the enemy. Scarlet Infant orbits will cause a blood explosion. Hmm. Yeah, seems pretty good. And it seems good that we can double it as well. I like that. Okay, we've got a lot of bombs now, so we can go back and get that tinted rock. Let's quickly speed back. Oh god. At the minute it just spews out it just spews out blood. I better be a tinted rock. I better not go all the back all the way back here and it not even be a tinted rock. I'm pretty sure it was though. Oh for fuck's sake! That shouldn't even be goddamn possible. I think it was only repentance that changed it to where it can drop no soul hearts at all. Like, a golden chest is at least something a little better, but fucking a bomb and a key? How dare you? Remember when uh, Tinted Rocks used to give, like, almost exclusively two soul hearts, and that was, like, basically their only drop for the longest time? That was wild times, man. That was wild times. Come on, you know you can die. It's easy enough. It's easy enough. There you go. Absolutely wrecked. Wait, what? Are you seriously not dead? <laughs> yeah. A bit silly, that was one of them. We lost some tears, but we gained some damage, and we gained a good amount of other stuff too. Good. Gramps' head, unfortunately, ain't my bag. Right. Okay. We keep this rolling. I don't know how long this run's going to stay together for, I'll be honest. I don't know how long we're going to keep this this one sane. I don't know how to get the ball rolling with these little scarlet dudes sticking to enemies. Sometimes they seem to stick to them automatically, other times not. I'm not quite sure why, but there you go. Stuck, stuck to them this time. And then it blood explodes. Cool. I, I like this this little fella. This little fella's pretty good. 
we like him. We like him a lot. Oh my god. At least we got fucking insane damage right now. Otherwise, this would be a shitter. Luminary Flare's a fun one. And again, one that I don't know if it counts as a familiar. It definitely should. But I don't know if we can duplicate it with the box. I don't even know what duplicating it with the box would actually do. I don't know how I wasn't hit there, I'll be honest. I have no idea. <laughs> I'll just accept it and keep moving along. Okay. Keep it going. Oh, there you go, Flare. Pop off. Um, move close to enemies can fix it with a crippling effect that causes them to take double damage. Ooh, yeah, that seems interesting. It depends on how close I've got to get, though, to be fair, to how useful that is. But the double damage sounds good. I'm not going to move close to those enemies because that seems scary. Oh, okay. I've, I've literally got to like slap them with it. That's kind of interesting. I think it's going to be difficult to utilize that. Um, maybe I can just get it going on bosses. Don't know if it was worth losing my poison damage. I'll... I'll have to see. Um, ooh, Alabaster Box is a bit saucy. I'm going to buy it just because it's stats. I don't think I actually want the Alabaster Box because I think that will uh, be my demise. I also quite like my active right now. This active do be pretty decent. Ooh, a Soiled Heart that doesn't do anything when you have Soiled Hearts only. Another Soiled Heart. God damn. There you go. I got the double damage going. Although it only applied to the foot, apparently. Didn't think that would be the case. There you go. That's, that's working out nicely. Beautiful. We'll quickly check out this in case there's anything life-changing in here. There is the wafer. That's pretty life changing. Let's let's grab the wafer. Considering our active item, I think it's well worth doing this. And also, we can do this double damage thing, which means that bosses go down pretty gosh darn quickly. We're able to kind of schlibbity slap, fellas. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. We can do it as the spawn as well as you just saw. I, I, I'm glad I took this. It's actually quite, quite easy to hit them with the effect. And we got double soul hearts there from one of the rocks. Thank you. We actually might gain health from coming in here. Apart from when I walk into something that I'm unsure of. <laughs> look at that. Oh my lord. I don't know why it's not slapping this guy, though. I got pretty fucking close. I got very close to you. Slap the guy. God damn it. Slap the guy. <laughs> oh my god. I don't know why you guys aren't getting up and doing stuff, sadly. I think Lumi Flare is duplicating, you know? Because, um... Definitely seem like a lot more fiery explosions than normal. Oh my lord, I didn't see that foot coming. Bugger off, Skolex. Yeah, look at that. That's like triple the amount of them. Come on, Flare. Do something, boy. Can't get close to this guy. He's got too much creep on him. Nope. Get out of here. Same with you. Oh, dude, this is a nightmare fuel set of bosses right here. I got all the rings. How are you not dead, good sir? How are you not dead? All my Isaac players hate this boss. 
Oh, Parasite's doing some interesting stuff here. Come on, death animations. Don't be too fucking long. Wow. That was a whole ass waste of time. Death animations on that were awful. Fuck are you, little ghosty boy? Why are you always fucking with me? Oh my god, my bandage girls are doing work right now. Okay. Good, good. Things are dying equally as fast. We're dealing with them. We're dealing with them. Oh, there you go. We got Explosiva. Not bad at all. Okay. Good, good, good. Sadly, we have to elite, like, Alleviate all of our minions that we've hired. Let them go. And make our own way. We will see how all of this ends up going. Reasonably well, I hope, but our health is not great right now. Explosivo should help with bosses, though. Even if it can be a little dangerous at times, it's, it's overall good. Stop going for me. I don't need money. Sadly, even though I do have Keeper's Balls, didn't really get to use it. Would have liked to have kept Keeper's Balls going, but... Oh, bollocks. Oh, I've got, I've got, I forgot that I do have the Wafer now. I do have the Wafer, so... That damage that I just took there isn't as bad as I initially thought. We can have Solace in that fact. Yeah, I didn't want to deal with you. Thank you, Flare. Dude, you can hit way too often right now. This might end up being a death, yeah. This might end up being a death still, I'll be honest. I'm not... I just aren't playing well at the minute, like, at all. I'm just not focused. Oh, like that. What was I thinking there? I thought the spikes had gone down after combat. I just need to play a bit slower and more methodically. I'm, 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 I feel like I'm rushing, but I'm not rushing on purpose. Do you see what I mean, people? Do you see what I mean? This is coming to a swift, swift end here. Come on, dude. Just, just die already, thank you. I'm gonna need a tinted rock very, very quickly. Please, very much, sir. Even you can go quickly. Good, good. Okay, we managed to hit him with a double damage thing. Yes. Unfortunately, we did just get a bandage girl, which isn't particularly useful for us. It does mean we get to level 3 and 1 use of it, usage of our active, but if Electric Dice was working, it would be there much, much quicker. But it just doesn't work at all. There's a few things in there, something wicked, that are a little bit broken at the moment. The new updates seem to have broken a few items here and there, but they'll, they'll get fixed in good time. All in good time. Oh god, I'm, I'm still really worried about my health. I've taken some very bad damage as of late. I think I'm also just excited to, like, play Red Dead after this. I'm enjoying Red Dead quite a bit at the minute. I'm rushing to go and play Red Dead. I shouldn't be. I should be taking my time. Come along, good sirs. Join us at the death. Ooh! A trinket paying off, baby! Paying off and giving us fucking Mars. I don't even know why I'd take this, but I just feel bad leaving it there. But hey, her. Hello, little fly. Are you okay? Oh, I got hit there. My bad. Who's who's betting it'll be Mars that kills me? Who's thinking it'll be Mars that kills me? I like the way that you just sit on top of the flare, that's enjoyable. Damn it. Well, why, why is there just a ring of tears chilling there? That makes things a bit harder. Okay. 
Okay, nice. We managed to get through Mum at least. Ooh, hello. Ooh, hello. Okay. Managed to save ourselves there a little bit. Managed to save ourselves. Wasn't expecting to, but I can be glad of it. Dude, we're only on 19 minutes in this run. This run's been quick. This run's been speedy, speedy. I mean, I've done boss rush and stuff, and we're, yeah, we're only at 25 minutes. Wait, uh, the, the recording's only at 19 minutes, because I bloody chopped it off halfway through, didn't I? Yeah, okay. It's not as quick as I thought. It's still quick, but it's not as quick as I thought. For some reason, I thought we were here at 19 minutes then. I was like, whoa, shit. That's kind of wild. You had to trap me, didn't you? Trap me somewhere where I can't even shoot you. This is bullying. Get out of here, I bomb you. Or somehow pulling through. Ah, bollocks. All we need to find is a tinted rock here or there, and we're kind of set. Because that'll give us two extra hits, maybe four. If we're lucky. Mars actually saved my life there. Good. Which is something you can't say often for Mars. But I actually used the iframes to uh, be able to skip past the enemy that was shooting at me. Right. We should be on the right path here by the looks of it. Should be on the right path. Get that double damage swing. I really like that as an item. It's really cool. I don't know why it replaces our poison though. It seems as a, as a, a tainted version of an item. It seems kind of weird. One last guy. One last guy. Ooh, I kind of would like to get to those cards, but I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. Is it still the right way? Ow. Ow. Dude, fucking stop. How is there still more rooms? This is so long. There you go, finally. Good to go? Yeah. Alright, hit you with a double damage. Get hit myself. Very fast kill on him though. Very fast kill. Yeah, I've got room to stitch these videos together and not upload them separately, because otherwise that's going to be uh, a bit jarring for you guys. I guess I could stick with the book, but I'd rather keep this thing on me. Right, just hope we can go the right way. Thank you, Flair. Does some beautiful business for me. Oh, what hit me there? God damn it. Walked right into something, but I'm not sure what. A hey, double damage on you. I, I really like this. It's got some risk associated with it, but it seems to be regularly worth the risk to get that extra double damage. Because you, you get it for a while as well. Once it's applied, it lasts a good good amount of time. I like that. Seems like a room to double up. Not that I've got great doublings right now, to be honest. Like I said, this this would be a lot, lot better if I had electric dice working. Ooh, will it double these guys, though? Yes, it will. Yes, it will. Okay, that's really good. Doubling these guys. These guys can put out a lot of damage, so... Of course, this is the wrong way. Why wouldn't it be? Why fucking wouldn't it be? Can never go the right goddamn way. You watch it go straight into the first dead end as well here. Yep. Knew it. Knew it. Straight into the dead end. Okay. Let's go the actual right way now. Oh my lord. I think we have enough health to get there. I think. It's kind of hard to say. Do I need to kill everything in here or just the nubbins? I think just the nubbins, right? Stop drugging me. Yes, okay, good. 
Sometimes you have to kill those little drug guys, sometimes you don't. Ah, that didn't kill you? Fuck you. Right. This. This, I say, is the right way. I'll get hit to find out. Oh my lord. Don't step to me. We're all connected. We're a hive mind. The girdy hive mind. Be careful. Oh! What in the fuck was that, Mars? That was the most fucking backwards ass Mars I've ever seen. I literally went backwards. What are you doing, game? But yeah, having these fistula things um, with, like, in Boss Rush where I used my axe a bunch of times would get really wild. Here we go. Because, yeah, it does double them look. So they would get uh, pretty wild. If we could use our axe of a ton of times. Oh, Mars, don't be like this. You know you're playing me a fool. Really, he managed to dodge all those fistula dudes there. That's heading into his ghost form. Mars! Why you gotta be the way that you are, Mars? Why you gotta be like this? Yeah, oop, we got a half soul heart there. It's pretty good, it's an extra full hit. I think we're pretty much golden here, it's just timing. There you go. Oh my god, okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this one, a lot of fun, and yeah, see you guys in the next one.